Hi, I'm Vlad and today me and my crew will love to tell you a lot of interesting information about our daily lives here in this spaceship. I would like to start by presenting to you what exercises we are doing to remain in shape. First we start pedaling a stationary bike and running on a treadmill. We also quote unquote lift weights to help our upper bodies remain in shape. But in space the, everything is weightless so we use a um, resistance exercise device to simulate the, impressions of, the impression of lifting weights. All of this takes about 2 hours. Now I'm going to let Rares talk. Hi, I'm Rares and I will tell you what you can do as we reach our destination to Mars. First of all, whatever you do, will be difficult to move because you have an astronaut suit on you and it's hard to move in it. First of all, we are in the space, uh, when you are in the spaceship, you should always check if you are going in the right direction or if uh, all the engines are working and if something has broken. And in the remaining time, you could uh, eat something if you are hungry play games with a crew, or just to admire the space. Now I'm going to hand over the communications to Joachim. Hi, I'm Joachim and I present you what food do astronauts eat. First of all, they need to consume around 3000 calories because they do a lot of gymnastics. The food must have many vitamins without salt and taste good. Some of the dishes are meatballs with crab, muffin with chocolate, and a little cake for, with lemon. Food uh, sent into space must be avoided by heating processing due to loss of vitamins. Now I'm going to hand the communication to my last crew, Octavian. Hi, I'm Octavian and today I will present you how astronauts sleep. In principle, the place where an astronaut is dressing are space pajamas. They take a nap in a sleeping bag attached to the wall of a small room that looks like a telephone booth. The cab is located vertically, but this is not very important in zero gravity conditions. The sleeping bag has two holes through which astronauts can pull pulls out his arms to operate the laptop fixed inside the cabin. Sleeping in the cabin is quite strange, but you get, to it, you, you get used to it, it with the time. This was our project. I hope that one day you will travel with a spaceship like us.